Deputy Master of Company Guyana Institute this afternoon. And they're getting ready to tell you of a journey of different things that they're going to be embarking on. As well as uh, doing some comedy for you guys in the near future right here in the mining town of Linden. You know, we got so many talented, um, you know, comedians across our country and uh, right in our areas. But of course, um, they're coming to give a different spin to it. And I've got the legendary Chow Pao in studio. <coughs> straight to Linden and he's here to tell you and introduce you guys to what they've got planned for you guys. Uh, we're talking with them and uh, taking some great ideas, some great initiatives that they've got planned away for you guys. So of course we got Stoke Studio and he's going to be sharing with you guys what's on the menu when it comes to the delivery of comedy and some mixed flavors. Ciao, Paul. Wow, go on, my brother. <laughs> my name is Stan. Good afternoon. It's a lot everybody. First of all, um, coming to Linden is the long time I haven't been in Linden, you know? Yeah, that was the road. And turning into, from off of the highway. Yeah. It's like, yo, bro, you're going home, bro? Yeah. You know, you come to the place for a long time, man. Well, we the play, even the turning, even the turning, it look different than one of the right kind of turning, man. What kind of little junk on that? Hey, I got things going on, man. Different things, a lot of things happening, buddy. Yeah, you man. know, what don't happen in, in, in a year can exactly. happen in a day. Yeah, you know man. what I'm saying? Yeah, man. Lots of things, lots, lots of things happening. And, All right. uh, mm -hmm. and I'm happy to be back uh, to doing stuff in Linden again. Linden seems to be the place where everything begins. Uh, Marshall Money began here. Yeah. And I don't know if you know about the Chow Post Comedy Jam. That was that started here back in 2011 yeah, at, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. at Life's Just Hot. Yeah. You know what I mean? So we're back here, but not more for the comedy. The comedy is going to be a boom because mm -hmm. it's six of the best stand-up male comedians. I call him the bad boy is the guy in his comedy. The bad boy is, bad boy is the guy in his comedy. comedy. And we're we going to be ruthless, you know. Yeah. But I'm going to come to the comedy later. Yeah. Um, but more importantly, what's happening is we're using this opportunity to carry the works of the Rebirth Center. Mm -hmm. um, now, this is a center designed by Andre Wilshire and company. I think Mr. Edgel... Edgel and some other persons are on board. Mm -hmm. This is a group set out to offer support mm -hmm. to the existing in institutions like the Human uh, Ministry of Human Services, yeah. um, all the other um, um, places like that, the rehab centers, mm -hmm. um, so that when we go, we do workshops for the kids mm -hmm. and we invite them mm -hmm. to be part of the workshop. Mm -hmm. So this is also on board. It's happening on the 3rd of December at Lycius. Nice. This theater exchange, as we call it, nice. will involve theater and presentations on substance use disorders. Well, mm -hmm. we know how substance is going. Yeah. Them youth man using anything mm -hmm. for their eyes. Mm -hmm. Man tell me, yeah, they show boy for the new thing for their eyes. Say, boy, they say, cow down. <laughs> say, cow down? <laughs> you know, they cow down, bro. The man say, show boy, you don't understand you. this thing. It's got to catch it fresh from the cow. Oh, as soon as last time you cover it to the, uh, um, a saucepan, yeah. right? And, and but 10 minutes after, just yeah. sniff up a smell and boom! What? I said, boy, you How like, do you smell when you know, I don't know, you know. <laughs> 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 Gotta be like, how long? <laughs> you know what I mean? So, why is we laughing, right? Yeah. It's a serious issue. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The kids are getting high and they're yeah. doing crazy stuff. Mm -hmm. And we want to give them a chance to, to know about stuff yeah. because a lot of people know I'm a recovering drug addict. Mm -hmm. And there was not programs like, like uh, for me when I was young, mm -hmm. to say, well, yo, Chow Pao, be careful how you're stepping because this could happen to you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. There was not no one to tell families, well, this is what to look out for in your kids. Mm -hmm. and like when they're coming home, yeah. so you can look and see, well, hey, this mm -hmm. kid might be using it. You need to check it out, yeah, you know, yeah. because mm -hmm. a lot of people, a lot of people, um, when they when you think they start playing around with substances, mm -hmm. right? They do it for fun and, and mm -hmm. stuff. But mm -hmm. twenty percent of the people who play around with, with, with drugs, alcohol, mm -hmm. and other drugs mm -hmm. become addicted. Eighty percent don't. Mm -hmm. But you don't know which group you fall into. Mm -hmm. You understand? So and the best thing and, to do is demand reduction. And, and I think it's, it's it's a great initiative because only I think about three or two days ago, back Andrew. I was having this conversation on the radio and I was speaking about, you know, um, this guy that was on, uh, was in the newspapers, one of the newspapers, yeah. and he was speaking of his life and the comeback that he got yeah, I saw after some sort of abuse. I think he's and five then, years you know, he went, Yeah, and he got a, a degree, a bachelor's yeah. degree, and now he's on the road of, you know, raising he's a family. Yeah, and doing very great. But, um, you know, one of the things that, um, you know, I, I, I think doesn't happen in Guyana is that um, we don't, the adults, even though we are aware that, um, you know, persons get into substance abuse and it's very prevalent, yeah. sometimes we don't know what are the signals or the signs to look, for, to look for in right. our in our case. So I hope that you guys will be able to touch on that yeah, definitely. and have much more, not only for the kids, but if we have this for the kids, but of course, um, you know, to educate 
the elders, the parents, as to what to look for because the time in their time and this time is it, it, a completely different era. Like you, you just made a good comparison there. What did yeah. I say? He finds something different now. So, um, you know, you got to be looking for different things based on what you would have been accustomed to yeah. because, you know, they can definitely trick you. Right, definitely. You yeah. got a smart body you now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. they, got, they got the internet on the side. You yeah. know, they have the internet. So, mm -hmm. this program, when it starts um, at 1 o'clock, mm -hmm. is going to be um, running from 1 to 3. Like which, 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 which date? Um, on Sunday, December 3rd. Okay. December 3rd. Mm -hmm. All right? And it's going to run from the 1st to the... From one to three o'clock, mm -hmm. and it's gonna have we're gonna have the substance use disorders mm -hmm. um, um, presentation by the report center, Miss Sandra Buffett. Everybody mm -hmm. knows her as Granny. Mm -hmm. She's gonna be up here. Mm -hmm. um, the Ghana Police Force has signaled that they're gonna come and do traffic awareness and road safety nice. for the kids nice. because everybody want to buy a license. But yes, really. yeah, you know, do your thing, but know yeah, what you're yeah, doing. Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. so mm -hmm. we want to um, do that. We want to uh, present career opportunities. I think the Len, Len is on board with mm -hmm. that. Um, career opportunities in terms of. Linden yeah. and also the opportunities in oil and gas. Nice. And um, we also want to do conflict resolution because it seems that every time you mask somebody to in school, they get on a knife to your back. Yeah, yeah. So okay, we need yeah, to yeah, yeah, we need to give the kids yeah. some tools mm -hmm. to, to work with. Yeah. All right. Um, don't just sit and blame them because mm -hmm. the internet has got them going crazy. They want to try everything they see. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, just the other day was called the school on the east, uh, the east bank, the east coast. Sorry. These children are playing something named Charlie. We are spin something like this, and whoever it leaves points into, yeah. that person has to take on a dare. And they dare this girl to cut her hand. Wow. And she went ahead and cut her hand. Wow. It was good luck. They were in the school doing the work, so the she social worker. Almost. Yeah, the so social worker was on board right away yeah, yeah, to take yeah, care of the yeah, issue, bro. Charlie, it's a new, this yeah, it's a new game. game. Yeah. yeah. So you got to roll them kids. You got to yeah, be up, yeah, and, yeah, but yeah. you have to do some prevention. Mm -hmm some prevention workshops, mm -hmm. and this is what this workshop is all about. I think this is a great initiative. I must commend you guys for um, you know coming with this kind of initiative because we need this in our society and our community today. Yeah. As you mentioned, um, you know, uh, even though you guys deal with comedy and bring humor, mm -hmm. most of what you guys do is to what you guys can relate to, what our community and society can relate to. And I'm glad that you guys can find a platform that we can mix this as well. Yeah. You know, to create that awareness in our youths and more so to bring that awareness to the entire, you know, general populace in the society as well. Yeah, man, and we'd be happy that Lyndon is receiving us at Oak Moms. Mm -hmm. Lyndon's special to me, because Lyndon is the first people that ever boo me on stage. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Lyndon is boo your body, you know. You, you can't come and do show me the you know. All you hear is, hey, Mr. Boret, yeah. come off the stage, you know what I mean? <laughs> 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 them people they ain't easy, boy, but I love them because they actually mm -hmm. helped me turn into who I am today, mm -hmm. because the next show I came back was a, was a was, oh my gosh, mm -hmm. MSC was crazy. Yeah, I, you know. So yeah, Lyndon, I love you, bud. You know, I really appreciate you guys. There are two, there are two people in Guyana, you know, a stand up, <laughs> and I don't love being on stage with as an MC. And that would be <laughs> Lyndon Joby Jones right. and Chuck Paul. Well, listen, <laughs> yes, you know, Joby Jones and, and I have not performed on stage for quite a long time. Mm -hmm. The last time we did it was for Uncensored. At the cultural center. Yeah. This year we've not been in Linden for don't know when. Mm -hmm. So this is like a special treat coming back to dinner nice. with these two, these Crashing two titles. these two. Yes, yeah, these two. <laughs> I don't know what they have to give us now, right? But the backup team mm -hmm. um, with Chris Gopal and Michael yeah. Beyonce. Mm -hmm. You know the guy with yeah, Beyonce, yeah. Michael mm -hmm. Nations is there. Yeah. Mark Luke Edwards is mm -hmm. there, and we got Crazy Ace. Yeah, I know Crazy Ace is a singer. Yeah. But Crazy Ace is a very good comedian. When I could listen to his book, you know, like, yeah, that's, that's my talent. foolish. That's some talent. Yeah. I can tell him where he's full of whatever. He's full of something. I don't know how to pronounce the word clean out of Anyway, <laughs> so you've got the best mm -hmm. in Linden for the night. Mm -hmm. And um, so it's a full pack. This happens on the same day. The same day. Okay. Same day. Okay. Same day. Right. Um, mm -hmm. For the kids from one to three, mm -hmm. big people come out from seven to whenever the show done. Mm -hmm. You're going to laugh till your belly mm -hmm. hot you. the same venue. Yeah, the same, same venue. venue. Yes. Right. If right. y'all got problems, but bladder problems, we mm -hmm. cannot help y'all. Yeah. We can only help y'all map of the place. We, 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 we have to do some installation or hire some more from C1. Yeah, we got to have C1 till from come. I think that I own one of it, man. I think I to own C1, man. The create the extension by the Time. Yeah, man, when the people get here, put the C1s up here, make money, yeah? All right, a lot of got to be clean. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> a lot of people up here adding to the Earth's crust. I know you know. Yeah. So, yeah, it's happening. Um, let me say right now, registration. Let me go into that because there's no time running out. Mm -hmm. Registration, you can call 626-1420 mm -hmm. and register your child mm -hmm. for this 
event on Sunday. We only have space for 50. Mm -hmm. But Mr. Henry, mm -hmm. and Inspector Henry says, Chow mm -hmm. if you want to get some more kids, let me know. All right. And we can have them on board. So we don't know how much we're looking at now. All right. And yeah. I want to thank him for the support right mm -hmm. away. Because, yeah, Mr. Henry. Yeah, does yeah amazing portion right yeah. there. He's like, mm -hmm. yo, Chow Pao, don't send out to me, yeah. that's you. Mm -hmm. And so many people got this right now. I feel like, if you all, this is going to be super. Nice. You know, so. Nice. Um, call 626, um, no, get WhatsApp, sorry, 626-1420 and 637-667, sorry, 667-3999. Wouldn't be a good thing to have those right. registration forms placed at various we, schools? Well, it's going to be on online on Facebook and other places right, great, from great. in the morning. Yeah, great. We just got the confirmation from everybody who's going to be mm -hmm. presenting, so mm -hmm. now we're ready to put the information out there. Nice. So nice. you guys, hit up Chopo um, on Facebook, mm -hmm. um, follow GT Memoirs, and mm -hmm. you guys are going to get the information coming, right? As in terms of tickets for the comedy show, they're mm -hmm. available now. Mm -hmm. um, the early bird tickets. Now, mm -hmm. no, like just how could only hold about 300 people. We can't hold more than that. We wish we could hold yeah. like cultural center, but mm -hmm. you know, just like how they're building one track over there one side, they tell them they're not cultural center because over they got enough artists. You know? yeah, yeah. All they got to do is put up a car and you see how much artists is coming from there and win the car too. Fully. And how much are you having up to now? But three, four, five, five, how many? Three. Uh -huh. <laughs> You want it again? <laughs> <laughs> right. So tickets are available at Muslim Stop Shop. Mm -hmm. The advanced tickets are two thousand mm -hmm. dollars. Now, if you go to Muslim Shop and you pay two thousand dollars and you see the ticket mark twenty five hundred, mm -hmm. just know you get five hundred dollars back. All right, nice. Right, okay. right away. But nice. only a limited stock is there. Mm -hmm. So yeah, go buy me out early. Yeah. And you guys can enjoy yourself. And look for the twenty five hundred dollar one. Ask for the $2,500 one. <laughs> uh, uh, but even if you're going to ask the $2,500 one, no, you're not getting $2,000 one now. But when you're done, write the $5 and make it and pull up. Uh, <laughs> right. Okay. That's the way we talk, the way so, we talk about one of yeah, the you know, nice greats in terms of comedy. Tell you guys what to expect on the 3rd of December. I think it's a great initiative. And of course, it's great to have that kind of collaboration in our society community. Final, uh, before we wrap up the show. Yeah, um, well, there's some people supporting this. Um, mm -hmm. We've not got support from, you know, big companies as yet, but the Ghana mm -hmm. beverage, beverage company, right? Mm -hmm. have come on board with us. Mm -hmm. um, Caribbean uh, Power Jam Radio, mm -hmm. back in Brooklyn. Um, yeah. They've come on with us. I think you guys know what's at Guyana, yeah, what's Johnson, Guyana. Mm -hmm. right? They're mm -hmm. supporting this as well. Miss mm -hmm. um, Dory Clark and mm -hmm. some other people are showing a little fine needle on them. Yeah. Um, a guy I can't remember the guy. Mobile World. Mm -hmm. huh? Mobile World. Mobile World. All right. I'm mm -hmm. um, just coming in there. Mm -hmm. um, he supported us a bit. Mm -hmm. So we're out there seeking support because we're getting the lunch for the kids. Yeah. Um, got this thing to look after. So mm -hmm. anybody out there want to chip in, please feel free. Mm -hmm. um, call, call the two numbers, 626-1420. Uh, mm -hmm. and, um, and come on board with us, man. And we're not going to be doing this alone here. Um, Rockstone, I'm sorry, um, we, we didn't raise the funds yet to reach to you guys, mm -hmm. but if you guys could come down, yeah. um, we can have you, because Rockstone is calling for the same um, program for the kids, yeah. Let Him is calling for the same program for the kids, mm -hmm. Bartico and New Amsterdam, nice. so it's going to catch on, and we just hope that we get support, we don't, we don't look at face. Support mm -hmm. is support. There's kids out there that mm -hmm. need some guidance. Yeah. If you could give them some preventative workshops. Yeah. And here's a bill. Why not? Awesome. And, and why not use your occasion to make y'all laugh at the same time? Awesome. Beautiful. You know, with a big stupid one, Jumpy Joe. Jumpy Joe's Jumpy Jones want to analyze me, but we recent situation. And I said, Jumpy want to analyze. Uh, uh. You know, man, jump because I know half limit. Not because I got some kind of personal issue. There's mm -hmm. not this thing for make laugh off of. All right. So y'all to analyze the hell out to me. As a matter of fact, Linda, when y'all come, you have to come and pet me, but not with no tomato and brick, you know, man. You have to go there with your wallet and pet me, because I know you are getting the 25,000. Yeah, they're getting the 25,000. Thanks for the show, boy. Shots. What? <laughs> so, so, so most of the top of the tickets are already more than $2,000 grab them, guys, and mm -hmm. that's, that's how a great show. All right. I'm going to be thanking you for coming through and sharing with us. Of course, we're currently going to be a part of it, support it. Great initiative, and um, I think it's, it's, it's an area where we need to step up on. And um, commend you guys to be a part of this and do this as well. All right, yeah, man, thanks a lot for having us. Well, I want to follow looking good. And who's this DJ, right? Goes by who's the name DJ? of Selector Andrew. You Andrew, glad yeah. you pick a name like Andrew, not yeah. slim man, fine man, yeah. you know, not eating. And yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> why I show you all the DJ because y'all don't think I'm mad at right? Why don't I show you all the DJ Andrew? The boy, you see the good thing in him, Andrew, like yeah. eating, yeah, I don't want to get the. Like DJ Pencil. <laughs> Let's play it all. Right. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
well. I'll tell you guys what to expect. And of course, um, you know, we can look forward to you guys supporting this as well. All right. Since that was 44 o'clock, gotta give you that booming four and my four vibes here on the afternoon log. Then if you continue, all right.